Good morning. I thought you'd like to watch uh, some switching with your coffee on Saturday morning. Got the GP7 with sound back. So we're just going to swap out a boxcar or whatever. Going to keep it simple. And because uh, I use JMRI, <laughs> all the cars you're going to see are the ones I bought at the train show last week because JMRI uh, keeps track of car moves. And so they all have zero have the least amount of moves, so they're all going to show up in this train. Doing the vo voiceover outside again. Uh, everyone seemed to enjoy that. And that was a graduation parade we heard the other night. Uh, the graduation is this weekend but they had a community had a parade for the graduates since part of the year was virtual learning and everything so maybe we'll get lucky and hear a norfolk southern train this is a short video probably not though so all i'm going to do is i have to switch out the cadiz boxcar for the LNN boxcar in spot one. Pretty simple. I found that a little of the bell goes a long way. So I don't play it as much as the real railroads do. And I'm sure most of you will understand. Of course, if you're the engineer, you may not, you can probably barely hear it if you're in the cab of the engine. So we're just pulling the LNN boxcar. Uh, since I have two cars now, I do have to cross Douglas Avenue, so I'll have to blow for it. But since I'm moving so slow, I just gave it a real long blast. And didn't worry about the two longs, the short and the long. Never tried this before. I was afraid that the camera might tip over on on the cars, but it didn't. See my hand shaking a little bit there. Um, my family, it's sort of hereditary. Um, I can't remember what they call it, familiar tremors or something with my hands. Uh, my grandfather had it really bad, and my dad had it, you know, bad in his later years too, even though he's still built a whole lot of airplanes with it. Uh, but that could eventually cause me to move out of end scale. Uh, it's not bad right now, it doesn't bother me but, you know, we'll see how it goes. Probably shouldn't have zoomed in there as much because then you can't see where I actually spotted the car. Uh, it's just tough to operate the camera and the throttle and <laughs> at the same time when you're switching. If you're going you know, down the main line, it's not as bad.
the sound blipped on me a couple of times, but the uh, engine never did stall. Just sound cut out for a fraction of a second, which is annoying. But uh, if the engine doesn't stall, it's uh, I can live with it. So now we're just going to go back a couple on to the train. I do have to push it back a little bit because I pulled it too far forward and I need to uh, uh, access the crossover because the next move is going to be to switch out to uh, Union Spring. But we'll do that uh, in another video. So, hope everybody enjoyed their coffee and has a great weekend and uh, stay safe and I'll post some more videos probably Sunday, maybe Saturday night. 